guys, and it is goal goal one 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 back today with a first video in a long time. And wait. Told them that I, I need help, but then I realized that I'll be fine by myself and I need help. I don't know why I'm deleting any of this, but yeah. So I'm just gonna do a let's build of an RV because it's gonna be a big RV and I can't be bothered to do a tutorial. So let's just start with something like this. And this is a racetrack, by the way, that I've been building with a few builders. Um, right, so let's do this. Let's build it maybe here. And this is gonna be moved. I just want it to be on a grass area near this area. One, two, three, yeah. Just place another one and then maybe do like that. And this is the front wheel. Then maybe just gonna go up to here. And then one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. Three wheels and then like that. So it's a pretty big RV, right? And then you just want to do a free gap and close it off, right? So wait, yeah. So this is gonna go like two out in the back. Then you can just go ahead and delete all of those blocks. Then get yourself some stone slabs or any kind of slab just some stone then just literally fill it in and I may have to spit out depending on how it rotates but yeah wait I may as well just talk about a few things while I am doing this filling in so you might have been wondering why I haven't been uploading well that is because I was having severe internet issues and recording issues so first of all my in like first of all I was recording and then suddenly my internet just failed meaning that I couldn't upload so I had like recorded like maybe seven or eight videos at like mostly via tutorials and a showcase actually and a different RV build but yeah, so I was having internet problems, and then finally, at one point, I managed to get my get get a better internet because it turns out that I hadn't updated my computer for like five months, right? So I have to like I have to uh, I updated my computer obviously because that is what I had to do. I ended up updating my computer and my internet was working as well but then suddenly, then, not really suddenly but my trial for Camtasia ran out and that was what I was using to record I was on a one month trial and we're just placing some buttons there we were on a one month trial or I was on a one month trial you guys weren't in which I could like do whatever I want from Camtasia and then my trial went my trial was over and I was like oh well you know it's a good recording app so I guess I'll buy it and so I go on the I go to buy it and turns out that it's literally like three hundred dollars and like I guess that's how much like legit recording equipment is and but like I don't know like how serious of a youtuber I am I only have like five videos or something so I just thought, you know, not worth it, and I don't even have that kind of money. So yeah, that's a big problem. So I I decided to use QuickTime on my Mac, but the thing about QuickTime is that it lags so hard. Like I actually got my FPS up quite a bit. Normally it's on like 40 FPS with shaders, which is pretty good for a Mac. But uh, yeah, so this is the structure I'm gonna work with. And by the way, I'm sort of just like I think I saw Corrales or somebody build one, some big YouTuber. I think it was Corrales. 
build an RV and I'm just basing it off that sort of so let's just have a door there and yes yeah, so what was I saying oh yes uh, so Camtasia yeah so I, I couldn't buy it but it's tried in quick time and see I'm on like 26 FPS it brings me down to around 12 FPS and to a point where I can't actually record like and I can record but it's just like snow you know? there are points in life where I'm just like no 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 not worth it you don't want to record with 12 FPS right no no you don't so we can get some maybe some brown brown and gray oh my computer is really starting to make some noise right now I think this looks pretty good that a second layer of brown stained clay all around here and we get this cool texture Let's go all around and obviously we're gonna have some glass and stuff um, how's that look it's a pretty big RV Anyway, yeah, so I, I tried to use QuickTime, didn't work, so I came across a different app called Snagit, and this is basically just going to be like on the stacking things, and we can have a door up there, right, yeah, so let's just do a bit more for the exit area, so we could call out a shape like this, right, so I was basically on Snagit, I, I, I've downloaded something called Snagit and I'm on a trial for it and so it's actually doing it's like pretty good actually I mean it pretty much gets me the same FPS as Camtasia if not better which is amazing to be fair not to be fair to be honest like it's pretty good like it's, it's really good like compared to QuickTime it's amazing and I think it's like Fifty dollars, maybe. I'm not exactly sure. Buy it, and that is a price that I could consider, considering the fact that it's basically the same as Camtasia. In my opinion, there's basically no difference. So, what are we doing here? Maybe adding a little depth with the glass in the front, and maybe on the very top we could do brown wool, or maybe. We add a bit of red and get away with it. That would look good. Maybe never rack. Oh, and I'm on the use the block server using the use the box texture pack. Right. That looks good. That looks nice. So it's basically a combination of Flows HD and Estrelon community pack. The Estrelon. This up. And I actually have wild edit, but I don't want to use it for videos. So, there we go. It's the nice bit of stuff there. Right here, what we could add is this kind of block, maybe. It sort of resembles that. Hmm. Anything a bit better? Uh, I'm looking for something that looks like metallic, sort of. Could this work? I mean, I guess that we are going to go with. Hmm, like that. Get some ladders. Ladder in the very middle. Something like that with, I don't know, iron maybe in it. And then we can get some more iron frames on the side. And we could actually put some. Um, let's get red wool. Yeah, so snag it. Seems pretty legit. Much cheaper. Six times cheaper than Camtasia. And. I think that I could afford it, meaning that it may actually end up being worth it. I mean, you can't edit on it, which is pretty bad, but I can move it like a quick time video and then 
do like some sort of editing thing like that, and I think I'm actually gonna change this. So, add a ladder with a sign, and no, that's goal RVs maybe. There. Anvil. And yeah. I think we could add another anvil. So there we go. That is the basic structure pretty much. So let's get to a roof. We could use stone slabs and quartz slabs. That would good. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I saw this on a cr on the Kraus video, like, all credit to the, I think it was like, Holly Forefoot, like, if it was the Kraus video, I remember like, some guy called Holly 4499 or a girl called Holly 4499 had built an RV, and he or she did a pretty good job, so I'm kind of this front bit especially is kind of going off that design. So we can just sort of build out like that. And have slabs starting here maybe. Right? That look good. I'm not sure about glass bit and never rack up here. We could just use grey again. That look better. I'm sure you guys will have to let me know because we can going to do the interior and detailing, detailing in the next episode, right? So, close this off pretty much. Straightforward stuff. And what do, what, what do I have on? Oh, uh, yeah, we have a rubber duck head. I was helping Andy Yoda with video yesterday. So. And we were doing bathrooms, and that's why I'm wearing a rubber duck hat, because I'm spare for bathrooms. So let's just use this border around. Okay guys, I am back, sorry my sister was here and she asked me for a few things, so yeah, so I think I have a general idea for this, um, if we do like that, and so let's send that back a bit and then let's see what we can do here, just maybe add a few cool stair shapes. That look good. We could play around with this. Uh, maybe up to there. Hmm, how does that look? There's three of those, okay. So, basically. Break that off, and let's see. So we just place never right on the bed of the stairs. So that's full buck, and goes up here, and here is the changing point. I'm just doing this so I can see, guys. So like that, and like that. Yep it is, and there, no, that, that should be good, that looks good, it looks good, does it look good, it does, right, 
back to the front here. Is there anything else we could add? Oh, right, of course. Levers or things here. Double sided? Maybe not. I mean, I've never been able to make the good, like, a front of an RV look good in Minecraft. I mean, just not possible, if you ask me. And, like, a lot of people seem to be. And, oh, look at this. In this texture pack, you can get a creeper head. This looks really cool. Oops. Yeah, like, I've never been able to make a good RV front race area thing. I guess, like, that'll do. And we could just get ourselves some gray stained glass for the mirrors. Uh, yeah, so I, I see that people don't generally go for five white things, but I looked it up and like people generally do three white cars and RVs compared to cars are more than like are almost like twice as wide as them, probably a bit less than wide, two twice as wide, so five wide compared to three wide seems pretty good and I'll be right back. I need to check how much, how long it has been since we've been recording. All right, so back, guys, and yeah, we're back, pretty much. I was busy again, so I've been recording for like 15 minutes. So like another five more minutes. Let me just start me timer. All right. So is there anything else that we could add here? No, I think it. I think it looks pretty good back ladder maybe going up to the top because that's kind of something we should have maybe we could just put like that's a black hole buttons and we just get some standard iron trap doors Got this cool thing, and then maybe just some more lights. Red wool is good. So you could just climb on top of your RV, pretty much. All right. So let's go head on inside and think a good block for the interior. Would be to just put some standard white wool if we could get in. I'm just gonna do like that because it is impossible to get in. Get a lantern. Uh, yeah, just place lanterns all around. And then just want to fill this whole area in with white wool. All be all around. I'm probably gonna do some extensions. So this is basically just the the way the RV would look if it were to be moving, right? I'm if, yeah, this is what basically what the RV would be like if it were moving. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a not moving one. So what we can do is this go up to here like that and then I'm copy it with some word well that it because I have the permission for it. I'm just gonna go across this racetrack to an area back here. Which is going yeah, we're just gonna have some stuff here, so we can just paste it here for now. This is oops. Slash dash undo. Paste. There we go. And we have an RV there. And by the way guys, 
Um, I had an exams for a week, that's why I haven't been able to record. And my exams are over, and I have a one week holiday as, I don't know, a reward, a reward or something. I guess this whole system here has to do stuff like that. Anyway, so we're going to add some extensions, and we're going to use world edit because we can. Right, maybe we could extend out here to here. Slash dash one. And again, this is like totally copying the Corral's design. Oh well. Slash slash with one. Right? And then so I'm saying. Like this. And finally, like this. And I don't know how many people would actually do this, but if you guys ask me any questions, if anybody asks me a question in the comment section, I will answer that question. Or like riddle, I don't know, like whatever you wanna ask. You wanna trick me or something? Uh, you can't trick me. Impossible. So yeah, just you wanna fill in all of this. And these are basically like the extensions that come out when you park your RV. Like, I don't know if anybody has an RV who watches my videos, I doubt it. I mean But you know, I guess it's possible. I have 40 subscribers. Oh, uh, yeah. Thanks for that, guys. 40 subscribers. I really don't think I deserve 40 subscribers, but oh well. Uh, well I don't know, like, probably because I haven't been uploading. I don't think I deserve 40 subscribers. But thanks anyway for you guys who have believed in me. Alright, so there we go. And we're going to need to plan out the interior now. So let's get some planning stuff. Just want some blue wool. Plan it out. So like generally what they have up here is two seats. Uh driver area thing, you know, a bunch of stuff there. And we could even Yeah I can add a little glass barrier there with yeah, some stuff there. Then what we can do is add a window. Here. Right? Yeah, we have enough windows up here. Window there. And we want to do some magical windows here. So, kitchen. Up there. That's the way. It's gonna be our bedroom over here. Pretty big, actually. Maybe too big. Uh, bedroom. Bathroom. No. It's a waste of space. Pure big waste of space. It's gonna be hack up to you because artificial light doesn't give out too much light. bedroom right here, right? So, close that area off. We have a two thick wall. A bed. Closet. Sure. And we're going to use a different color wall as our wall. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, like that. Okay. Right, so we're back here, and what we could add is a kitchen area. Maybe there with a counter where people can actually do most of their seating. I don't know, 
but I think that what we should have is a table with those cutting chairs. I think those are good. And yeah, this is pretty much good enough for planning. That looks okay. This bedroom windows. Maybe one bathroom window in the back with some glass. Uh, bedroom window. Maybe no, we can just have one bedroom window. Right. So it's pretty big actually. Yeah. We should just get some trapdoors, maybe. Yeah. Then you can have these little public areas and you can close that at night time. Yeah. Sorry if I'm a bit quiet right now. My throat is totally. I don't know what's going on with me. So, get your glasses. Place them in. I think we have enough light in here now. Not sure now. Not sure now. Yeah. Because it is not symmetrical. So, right. This is the bathroom over here. That the bathroom can have trap doors like that, and bedroom oops, can have it can also have trap doors because the trap door is pretty, pretty cool. Trap doors are nice. Oops. Like open open trap doors being nighttime. Don't be nighttime. Open trap doors for you know other things. Uh, maybe we could just have a skylight here. A regular old glass. So Center just stretching along. That. Does that look okay? I think it does. And that, that there we go. So, how is this looking? And I think I have gone way past the time. It's been 25 minutes, and this is the longest video ever. So thank you for watching this video guys, this is Rubber Rubber 101, uh, Rubber Duck 101, Rubber Gold 101, what do you want to call me, I think this new hat, hat looks good, face, hat, yeah whatever, anyway I will see you guys in the next one, thanks for watching and bye.